below there, so 26 is a member, and this is Bree. Um, this whole litter, we, we're we going to call them kind of a little bit of late bloomers. They, it takes them a little bit longer as a schnoodle to kind of really kind of get their ornery, more playful side. You can see Bree's got some of that, but she's not quite there yet. Um, so really, this, this video doesn't represent what her personality will be at 10 weeks old when she's ready to go home very well. Um, you can see she's a little bit more careful about everything, takes her time before she really just jumps in and commits to something here. So, um, And that's just normal. No worries on our end there. So she's been to the vet. She passed perfectly medically wise. She's up to date on vaccinations and she's microchip. She does have one minor cosmetic defect. It's called an umbilical hernia, which is an alley belly button. So we do take $100 off. It takes about one stitch to fix if you decide to do that and costs less than $100 if you do it at the time of spaying. Let me know if you have more questions on that. Like I said, it's definitely not a medical concern, so don't be worried there. Um, most people actually just don't do anything with it, and they just let them always have their alley belly button. So, cradle her up here. All right, this is Bree, thank you.